Today I wanted to try my first lemon drop or ahi limon pepper. I am out here in my garden and it is 102 in the heat index right now so my sunglasses are completely fogged up. These peppers are originally from Peru and on the Scoville scale, they end up being around 10,000 to 30,000 Scoville heat units, which is pretty comparable to something like Serrano's. So it's going to be pretty hot, but not like ghost pepper, mind blowing, burn your asshole off hot. Now these plants are extremely productive. I've got just, I mean, dozens and dozens of peppers on the plant, even though I live in a forest and they don't really get much in the way of sunlight. They probably get about six hours of sun right now, which is the most, you know, they've gotten all season basically. So the fruit has been a little bit late to come in and to ripen. They've been on the plant for probably 30 days or so, but this is the first one that's actually ripened too. You can see it's pretty much all yellow. There's just a teeny hint of green, but I'm calling it good enough. Now pepper plants normally like at least eight hours of sunlight, but usually closer to like 10. So six hours isn't quite enough and it's just creating a little bit of a delay in the ripening and stunted growth for some of the plants. But there's tons of fruit on plants so here in a couple weeks I think I'll probably have enough to make hot sauce out of which is going to be awesome. So I'm going to give this a little taste test and review for you. And I do have a little protein shake ready because I love spicy food but I'm not one of those freaks who's chomping down ghost peppers raw. I also like having a face and not melting it off. So here we go. It's instantly really, really fruity. Just spat out some seeds. Um, you get hit with like a lemon flavor. It's definitely citrusy. It's hot. It's not mind-blowingly hot though, it's, I mean, not extremely spicier than a jalapeno. It's not as hot as I was expecting, honestly. And right now I'm in sort of the bowels of hell, so I'm just like going to be drenched in sweat no matter what. The heat is starting to come in. Um, still it's not extreme. My mouth is starting to like water, but it's fine. I think this will go great in salsa. I think it's going to make a great hot sauce. I think pairing it with citrus is going to be the thing. It's going to be great. So I'm really excited to, you know, taste more of these as they ripen and they come in. I'm growing about 12 different kinds of peppers, so be sure to subscribe if you want to see more reviews. spicy but it's only spicy on the half of the mouth that I chewed which is really annoying. It's about 10 minutes later and I'm back inside and the spiciness is pretty much completely worn off so in about 10 minutes it's gone from Serrano hot to basically nothing at all so that's pretty quick. 